there guys welcome back to another video of all things apple plus i have an amazing video to show you guys today there was just a, a recent update uh to an amazing app that allows you to play third-party applications called extra ios if you've ever heard of it i'll be showing you guys that in the video today but if you haven't already on youtube please go ahead and leave a thumbs up like subscribe check out all things apple plus and uh, check out some of my other videos i got a lot of great tutorials out there that i hope will help you guys in your ios endeavors but let's go ahead and get into the matter of having to install extra ios to your ios devices so for that we will need to navigate into safari and i will be leaving the link for their installation page in the description below so make sure you guys do check that out but if you haven't or once you do navigate to here you'll notice that the installation page is just it's bright it's colorful the the icons really pop out it's just a complete overhaul on their on their application and on their software so it's just something that I, I would really recommend because they put in a lot of hard work into this application so make sure you guys hit the install app once you do you'll be given you'll be given a notification hit allow then you'll be brought into the install profiles go ahead and hit install and then type in your passcode and then from here it'll say thank you for installing I, or, uh, extra ios 5.0 and we'll go ahead and hit the install buttons one more time and then from there we can go ahead and hit done it will bring us back to safari but we can go ahead and navigate out from there and click our home button and you'll notice that you'll have a new application extra ios and once you do get it make sure that you do remove you move it to your front page because this is an amazing app that you're going to want on your device so from here let's go ahead and app open the application and from here you're seeing the actual main page of extra ios which looks very ios 12 like very new very fresh very user friendly and they even have this app section here a theme section there too or even a featured app section for their twitter plus plus or even their playstation 2 emulator they even have their own twitter page so even if you don't have a twitter account you can still follow up to uh, follow up and keep up with their twitter page and if there's any new updates any new uh features that are going to be coming out and they tweet about it you can stay in touch with them but if you do have a twitter account please follow make sure you ring that bell so you're notified of any new tweets that come out from the, any new updates that come from this app because there's just so much that they're doing here that it's definitely worth the follow definitely worth bringing that notification bell so please check that out as well too so even at the bottom of their page they have an apps section they have a home section apps uh themes and then they even have an info section at the bottom but let's go ahead and get into their app section so once you tap on that app box you can be you'll be brought to their main app section here where they have tons of applications that you can download emulators movie applications uh applications that are cracked like twitter plus plus or instagram plus plus their theme section here they even have a, a complete theme section that is currently under construction right now but it will be up within the next couple of days as themes roll in. They even in their info section, go ahead and check these guys out. I've actually been one of their testers. I've been lucky and fortunate and fortunate enough to test the application and it's just been a blessing. Under their settings app, if you notice at the top right, they have a settings app. They have a dark mode to their application. Who which third party application has a dark mode or a dark theme to their app nobody I, I i know tweakbox is the probably the only one that has maybe some sort of a dark theme to it but there aren't that many applications out there that don't have ads popping up all the time and that have in their own dark theme mode which is insane so it's just they've done so much on this application and then they even have a software update button if you notice that below where if there's any new updates any new features that come out you can tap on that software update button and it will automatically notify you if there is something coming out and if or if there's a uh, application or there's a software update that's available at the time so check out extra ios this is one of the probably the most user-friendly very just intuitive just an amazing app that's worth having on your app on your iDevice really and make sure that you do put that on your main front page because I'm trust me you will be downloading a lot from here the the main developer and devs from this application have been working super hard on this so let's actually go into downloading an application so I clicked off onto Bobby movie from there it'll bring you 
to their installation page where you just kind of have to wait about five seconds for the application to download. It'll say open this page in iTunes. We'll go ahead and hit open and then you can go ahead install as well too from there. And then from there you can go ahead and hit the home screen and you'll notice that the application is installing on your home page. Awesome. So now that we have it installed, we do need to trust the application. So let's go ahead and hit cancel, go to our settings and under profiles and device management, we can go ahead and hit trust and hit trust one more time. And then we can be brought back out to our main screen. And from there, we can go ahead and launch the application like normal. Now, Dubai Movie, we can go ahead and clear out any sort of ads or any pop-ups and we can even check off uh, a, a movie right out here. Avengers, let's go ahead and check that out. You may get a couple of, no, of um, ads, so we can go ahead and hit the cross button right there. And then we'll go ahead and hit the done button right there. Click that off. Click off that X there. And then you'll be brought to the actual main movie. So if you guys did like this video, if you guys do like what X iOS is doing in their community, go ahead and please like this video up. Please subscribe to All Things Apple Plus comment below, leave me a ring, let me know what you guys have been downloading through XRIS or if you have tried it out and what your guys' thoughts are about the application. I'll be catching you on the next one. Peace.